What I'm really excited about is to talk about the innovation workspace. This is our vision of the next generation Miro. We've all done diagramming on the canvas for ages since the real-time board days, but now, with one click of a button, we've got a diagram format on the canvas. We can enter a focused experience for building and constructing our diagrams together, check out our layers, all the tools at hand. Even the canvas experience is uh, optimized for diagramming. And ability to embed this diagram into another format helps us to stay collaborative and stay synced no matter where we are. I'm really excited to introduce our new slides format on Miro. So now, with one click, I can also create a slide format. You're still on the canvas, you can play around with building a fantastic narrative, rearranging your frames, and building the right story collaboratively with your team. We can do our interactive workshops directly in our slide format presentation. We have been live with Tables and Timeline and Beta since Canvas 24, and actually since then, the last few months, we've had more than a half a million tables created. We have new filters, so you can manage your filters and take a look at any of the, the columns and adjust the data set based on what you need to look at. You can sort, you can even group to filter these projects by team. You can build different views of the same data set as well and really powerfully embed those different views in other formats like slides. introducing creating prototypes out of a screenshot. So here I have a screenshot of a website um, and I can ask Miro AI to convert this to a clickable browser prototype. And this is super powerful because rather than me trying to describe the changes, the ideas that I have, I can just edit the prototype and share it with my team. I wanted to introduce you Miro Insights. It's AI synthesis that comes to the board. Let me show you how simple it is. So you can go to the dedicated app where you can see every single story that you have. And what it's going to show you is the core details of that request. But the beauty of it is this AI synthesis and aggregation of insights. So across multiple sources, so you can see here I have it from Gong, but it's also from Salesforce, from many other places. It will collect all the feedback that we receive from customers, aggregate it into the story, and tell you why that is relevant to that particular story. What you can also do is you can have it in the format of cards. So you see these cards? These are some of the, the stories that I found within uh, Miro Insights, and I want to focus on and start discussing as part of the bigger conversation. As soon as I open these cards, I will have the whole content of Miro Insights on the board. Here, you can see in the space, we now have sections. Sections are gonna help you structure and organize your content better. You can reorder sections, which gives you great flexibility. Also, you can add all the formats into a space from the Create menu. And you can see here, we have an option for embeds. We now support all third-party apps, things like Figma, Looker, Power BI, Microsoft 365, Google Workspace, you name it, we support it. What we wanted to introduce is how we're connecting many different templates, using spaces to connect the dots across these business processes. And that's what we're gonna actually call blueprints, right? And it's because we believe deeply that every organization has a different way of working. All of their approaches are subtly different. So we want to actually provide a blueprint of how to uh, transform their ways of working from goal setting, roadmap planning, design transformation, AI transformation. And so we have these blueprints in the template gallery, ways that you can start and really kind of tweak yourself to make it your own. Isn't that amazing progress for the innovation workspace? Yeah. Right, the soul of the collaborative canvas. Hmm reimagined in a way that's helping organizations think about their work in an AI-first world. Most of this is available today. The blueprints are in beta. 
in our capabilities, the spaces and beds, the formats, the create with AI table, amazing things that we're gonna see our community and our customers use immediately in many more things to come.